By 1952, the name Albert Einstein was synonymous with the word genius. Einstein was stopped routinely on the street by people asking him to explain those theories which changed humanity's perception of the universe. One inquisitive follower of Einstein's work was Dr. Waldron Gardner, a pathologist in San Francisco, who wrote Einstein on July 8, 1952. Dr. Gardner asked Einstein to help him understand why the physicist believed light from the star system was already four years old whenever Gardner peered at it in the night sky. Einstein replied in 48 hours, mere months, before he turned down an offer to serve as the new president of Israel and two years before he passed away. Einstein wrote the following reply to Dr. Gardner. Your difficulty stems from the fact that you do not distinguish between general and special theory of relativity, the latter being a limit case where you neglect gravitation. In the latter case, there are special coordinate systems, inertial systems, and with respect to such system, the concept of simultaneity has a sharp meaning and can be defined empirically by light signals. In general, relativity, the space and time coordinates have no direct physical meaning, so that also the concept of simultaneity, of spatially distant events, has no physical meaning. Physical meaning can be attributed to this concept only in certain special cases, which are characterized by certain symmetry qualities. Such case is not realized in nature, but in those idealizations which we use to represent expanding space, there are coordinate systems representing space-time in the mathematically simplest form. With respect to such coordinate systems, simultaneity has meaning, but the definition of simultaneity as defined in special relativity theory is out of place here. Although Einstein letters appear regularly in the market, those in which he specifically discusses aspects of his theory of relativity are rare. This letter, offered to the public for the first time, explains in detail the difference between general and special theories of relativity.